There was a time when wars were fought with guns and borders. Today, they fought with algorithms and deception. A few days ago, an image went viral online. It showed torch-bearing protesters flooding the streets of Ravlakot in Azad Kashmir. The caption claimed, People have come out on the streets tonight in Azad Kashmir. It looked authentic, it felt emotional, but it was completely fake. AFP Fact Check investigated that image and found something chilling. Hidden in the pixels was a watermark from Google's Gemini AI. When scanned through Synth ID detector, invisible digital fingerprints confirmed. It was AI generated. That protest never happened. It was not journalism. It was literally digital manipulation. A fabricated story designed to spread anger inside Pakistan. And this isn't an isolated case. India's growing information warfare network has been using AI tools to manufacture chaos, not only across borders, but inside Pakistan's narrative space. When protests erupted in Azad Kashmir, Indian accounts circulated dozens of synthetic visuals to exaggerate unrest, stir panic, and project instability. It was a digital infiltration, a psychological operation crafted in pixels. But the campaign didn't stop there. During the recent Afghanistan-Pakistan border tension, another wave of fake content appeared. Indian social media pages circulated dramatic images claiming that the Afghan Taliban had shot down a Pakistani fighter jet. Except those images weren't new. They were taken from Indian media reports of Indian Air Force MiG-21 and Sukhoi crashes in Rajasthan and Madhya Pradesh years ago. The same flames, the same wreckage, recycled from India's own air disasters, now used to spread anti-Pakistan propaganda. It was an extraordinary irony. India's own military failures repackaged as Pakistan's losses. Now, this is not creativity. This is information warfare. Instead of tanks, they use trending hashtags. Instead of missiles, they deploy artificial intelligence visuals and old crash photos. The goal is simple. Confuse Pakistanis, divide opinion and undermine credibility. The battlefield is no longer the border. It's your phone screen. Every share, every forward becomes a bullet in this invisible war. Artificial intelligence on its own is neutral, but in the wrong hands, it becomes a weapon, one that can manufacture outrage and completely rewrite reality. When AI-generated propaganda mixes with emotional nationalism, truth itself becomes collateral damage. India's use of fake visuals from Azad Kashmir protests to plane crash fabrications shows exactly how far this digital war has now gone. So then how do we respond? First, verify before you amplify. Second, educate. Make digital literacy a defense tool. And then third, hold platforms accountable for hosting synthetic propaganda. Because if truth loses its voice, chaos doesn't need borders. It just needs bandwidth. The fake protest in Azad Kashmir and the fake plane crash were not just lies. They were warnings that the next war won't start with gunfire. It will start with a post written by AI and believed by millions. Thank you for watching.